are only nine days left to get counted for the U.S. Census, something that happens once every 10 years. Now advocates and government leaders are sounding the alarm, asking everyone to respond before the September 30th deadline to ensure communities get their fair share of federal money and representation in Washington, D.C. 12 News reporter Kim Kalunian joins us now live with the new details. Kim? Well, like pretty much everything else this year, the 2020 census has been impacted by the coronavirus. And this once in a decade count was supposed to be done in July. But now the pushback deadline of September 30th is in the middle of a legal and political battle. Still, advocates want to make sure that you get counted. With just nine days to go, John Marion of Common Cause Rhode Island and the state's complete count committee has this advice to offer. You don't need to be paying attention to the latest twists and turns. Um, in federal court cases uh, or what's happening in Congress, you could just go to my2020census.gov right now and fill it out if you don't think you filled it out. Marion is encouraging folks who haven't responded yet to do so before September 30th rolls around. So the fewer Rhode Islanders who are counted, the less federal money that comes back to Rhode Island. Uh, and as you know, you know, the state of Rhode Island has had chronic budget deficits for, for decades, quite, quite honestly. And it can only hurt us to be undercounted. It's a call Fall Rivers Mayor is echoing, saying the city is massively undercounted and funding for things like roads, schools, and hospitals is at stake. According to census data, about 96% of households in Rhode Island and Massachusetts have responded in some way. Which sounds really good. But, you know, 5% is actually a lot. You know, it's tens of thousands of households. Leaving those people unaccounted for could lead not only to a reduction in federal funding, but the potential loss of a congressional seat for Rhode Island. I wouldn't say I'm optimistic we're going to retain it, but I think there's still a lot of uncertainty around that. It's an election year. A lot of people are focused on, well, I want to get out there and vote. Well, there's another civic responsibility, um, which is filling out the census. Now, if you still want to get counted, you can go to my2020census.gov. We also have a link on our website, WPRI.com. I'm Kim Kalunian, 12 News.